If you are working on a long project that is divided into small tasks, you might want to take a break once you complete one or a few of the tasks. Instead of resting after finishing a task, try this. Start the next item on your list. Do only a little of it, then take a break. Make progress on the new task while you already have energy and motivation. For example, if you are writing a book, instead of stepping away from your desk after completing a chapter, write the title and the first paragraph of the new chapter and then step away from your computer. If you are painting small square canvases to decorate your living room wall, instead of taking a short break after finishing one of them, place the new canvas on the easel and start a sketch of the new painting, then take a break. Another example, if you are preparing dozens of meals as part of your catering business, after preparing one order, start the preparation for another order, package one or two meals, then take a rest. The key point is to get started. If you don't start the next task before taking a break, you may find yourself delaying that pending task. Doing laundry, watching sports or scrolling down on Instagram may seem more appealing or possible. However, if you have already started the new task before the break, you will be more eager to get back to work. But occasionally, you may not be able to make much progress though, even if you manage to start your project. This especially happens while doing creative work such as writing a book or making a song. To find a way to move forward, shift your focus for a while. Frederick Nietzsche was a famous walker. He perfected his philosophy by walking long distances. Albert Einstein shifted his focus at home. He spent time every day daydreaming, mostly just by staring at the ceiling. Steven Spielberg takes advantage of driving to come up with practical solutions. During road trips, creative ideas come to his mind while he's not actively focused on the scripts and scenes. And he keeps a notepad nearby while driving. I don't know how he takes notes on a notepad while driving, but there is now voice assistants like Alexa to take notes hands-free. If you are still stuck while working on a complex task, use the trick in the next video to overcome it without losing an extensive amount of time or without asking anybody's help. Please subscribe to my channel so you get notified of my new videos. And let me know in the comment section about a long project you finished and how you manage finishing it. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.